Hi, it's Kelly here. And in this video, I want to talk to you about the greatest aspect of the Heartfelt Energizer movement that we have here and the handful of heroes who are participating in it. And, you know, you've heard me talk about some pretty uh, amazing things about it, you know, as far as eliminating the flu season and, you know, slowing down hurricanes. And uh, if you've seen the pictures on uh, whirlingbliss.com, you've seen the foot, the before and after pictures of a diabetic foot wound being healed, and et cetera, et cetera. All these different things about just how amazing the invention is, right? Well, the greatest thing about it actually is, is that it can't be stopped. You know, we're living in times when there are some very, very, very powerful forces, and you don't hear me talk about them too much. I try not to. Um, a lot of stuff going on, some challenges that just seem insurmountable in every aspect of our life, whether it be putting food on the table or whatever it is. You know, it's just everything, you know, and, and what's coming forward, you know, it seems like prices are going up faster and faster, et cetera, et cetera, and, and you know, all these different things. And I don't want to get into all of them, but you probably have a few of your own favorites. Or, or least favorites, I might say, of things that are going on. You're just like, oh my God, what? You know, how how can we get out of this, right? Well, as you know, the heartfelt energizer does exactly what the name says. It energizes a heartfelt feeling inside of you because your body is receiving fractal energy that's counteracting the the repeating energy that's coming from the cell towers and the cell mass and the, and the Wi-Fi and the smart meters that are outside our home or apartments or maybe a, a bank of s smart meters on your apartment wall, you, know, you, you might be living close to it. And all, that, all those things, right, that are putting out all this repeater energy. And what we're doing is we're transforming that energy because, you know, when it comes to a frequency, if it's a repeating frequency, it's the same frequency over and over again. Right? Well, what happens when it bumps into a, an irregular frequency? They both have to change. And they both change, the, the repeater frequency changes into an irregular frequency. And the irregular frequency just changes into a new irregular frequency. So it can't be stopped. And it really can't be stopped because whether you, you get the the discs that I've talked about, you know, the, the, the multi-wave oscillator discs, you know, the 200 millimeter, the 300 millimeter, there's even a, a 500 millimeter disc that you could get, all those things. Or people can, you can take a copper wire, you know, take, here it is stretched out, imagine that I have a copper wire in my hand, and you bend it in half, right? You attach it to a power drill, is the easiest way to do it, to take the, the, the closed end, you know, the bent end, stick it in the power drill and gently twist it like a twizzle stick, right? And then you can tape those on top of a ceiling fan. So, and that energy can go out. And it'll do the kind of thing that the discs do. Maybe not quite as strong, but, but the point is, is that if you're doing it, you're adding to what's going on. And so you take that, that copper wire, let's say it's this long. You put the, the bent end towards the center of the, of the uh, ceiling fan and the open end at the other end. But it's like a twizzle stick. It's, like, it's just like a stick, but it's twisted. And as I've mentioned before, that those twists in there give us a lot of different frequencies. So we put them on the fans. So no matter how powerful the people who have a different idea of how they want to run the world, how they want to be in charge and run our, run our lives and take away our freedom, well, how are they going to catch us? <laughs> because what we're doing is so, so simple. You just put one on each, each uh, blade of the ceiling fan. Or if you, you know, or you get the stand-up fans. And you put one of those discs on there, and you do it that way. That's a great way to do it. It's fantastic. 
and you know you can get one you can get two you can get five on a ceiling fan you might put two twizzle sticks on each each blade you know going out so if it's got five blades now you got ten of them going around and people have been writing to me telling me with uh, I don't remember the details now, but the lady just wrote on, on YouTube how it was just changing her life. She just she was sleeping so much better. Oh, she had a stroke is what it was, a few, you know, a couple, two or three years ago maybe. Uh, but she was not able to get rid of her limp. She was just having a, a lot of trouble. But finally, by doing that, bingo, she's feeling so much better. And she says she's in a small cabin and her daughter's in another cabin. Uh, next to her in a bigger house, and she said it's affecting her daughter. And what she does is the, these energies just make us feel good. And so what we're doing is we're making people all around the world feel good. And so this is going to change hearts. It's a heartfelt energizer, and that's what you're doing is you're changing the hearts, and you're doing it. And and unlike anything else that I'm aware of, uh, you know, there's so many tools out there you can buy and. It protects you at three feet or two feet or whatever. Or maybe you, you spend a lot of money and it, maybe it covers your whole house. But with, with the, the Heartfelt Energizer principles, you can do your whole neighborhood. You can actually do the whole world. And each person doing this is adding their part to it so that we will end up with Gardens of Eden everywhere. Everywhere. And this will be a whole new world, and they can't stop us. They cannot stop us. So I could, you know, if they found out what I was doing, they could, you know, tell me to stop or get rid of me or whatever they want to do, or, or maybe just because of my old age, I die. You know, who knows? But it doesn't stop us, right? And the other thing I might add to this is this book, Is There a Question That Heals Instantly? What we've talked about with the Heartfelt Energizer handles everything on the physical level. Anything physical, this can help in some way. This book helps us with the immaterial. And the question in here cannot be stopped. Is there a question that heals instantly? People sometimes will say that I'm so amazing or intelligent or this, that, or the other. And Whatever. Well, I got to tell you, the question that's in here is probably 50% or more of my ability to come up with things because the question gets my mind thinking and connecting the dots. And, the, you know, I've been told also that in my life I've been low energy. I think that has to do with my broken back. It takes a lot of energy to, that, just to function. And, um, Maybe you have a lot of energy. Maybe you've been a hard-working person. So by using this question, with all the things that you've learned, this will take you to levels that are beyond belief. So I invite you to get this book. And uh, is there a question that heals instantly? It's available on Amazon. I, I like the paperback because there's, there's this thing on the back here which I forgot to put in with the e-book, with the, uh, you know, the Kindle book. Um, and I think this is worth a lot if you can read this. Um, but in any case, get either one, whatever you like, and you take care and God bless.